It's my one life, and I give it everything I got. I am music. I am sports. I am the culture. Oh, man, the block is hot. Look, man, we always talk about how every time people see something good going, they got to come in and, and mess it up. We just on my platform discussed Lil Baby and how he extravagantly celebrated his 26th birthday with the likes of James Harden, P from QC, Meek Mill, Moneybag, yo, it looked like a beautiful celebration. Another person that Lil Baby celebrated his birthday with was obviously his lady, Jada. Come on now, they look beautiful together. Look at that, king and queen in action. Well, obviously, you're celebrating your birthday and everybody see you, you're living it up. There's always gonna be someone there to ruin the fun, tear down a great story. And again, I am not trying to excuse Lil Baby from any fault in this alleged affair. But uh, a porn star by the name of Miss London, she ruined Lil Baby's fun that he was having by getting drunk and running her mouth. And these are her words, not mine. So apparently she got on social media after it looks like her and Lil Baby maybe had some type of fling together. She posted, this is the best D I ever had. And it came from a millionaire who didn't say more than two full sentences to me. He literally beat me to the mattress soon as I got in the room. Not dropping no names, but Jada's not leaving this man ever. I'm home, I'm $6,000 richer, and I'm full of that 1942. I'm legit about to talk about this ish all night. I got new videos, and this one is popular. He know dang well he shouldn't have let us record it. It's, it's good, I'm never gonna get it again. My publicist has confirmed. I effed up before I even got in the house. I made a mistake, I'm logging off. I was wasted, all right? Now, she also posted some DMs between, it looks like what is her and Lil Baby, in which Lil Baby straight up asked, and I respect this, by the way, what's the point of paying for the pee if you gonna get online and talk about it? You effing the game up, that's bad business, mama. And then obviously you see Lil Baby's, his lady, Jada, uh, upset. She said uh, she's not gonna defend him, this dude is, uh, this woman is messing up the brand. She said, you you bad for business. Uh, other things that came out, uh, look, Jada went out of her way to, to buy Lil Baby this beautiful one of 12. Richard Millie's is what they telling me. She said, see, this is why it's best to just shut the F up and chill. Cause as soon as you show a little bit of happiness on the internet, MFers be like, I, I, I'm so tired of this ish. Like, even if that do be the case, what's the point of speaking on it out loud? That'd be the part that F me up. Like people not playing no more at all. Everything that need to be publicized, gotta stay prayed up. It's evil out here. Lil Baby did respond to these allegations. And to me, he seems to be admitting some type of fault in whatever situations or situationships happened with this young lady. He said, let my good outweigh my bad and keep pushing. That comes after Lil Baby tried to initially deny some of those allegations. But the chick got online and she legit was able to show the DMs and click on his page. Ah, when they do that, it's over. Uh, again, of her talking to Lil Baby. So, I mean, I guess there's some validity into the reports. Look, we got to call a spade a spade. That's corny what that chick did. And look, if Lil Baby cheated, you know, I mean, he got to deal with that in his household. I don't get into all that. I mean, people have relationship issues all the time. That's not for me to judge, man or woman. But when people talk, about it to me that's corny because if this was a guy we just called hit maker young bird corny last week for going on camera doing an interview with nori and drink champs and talking about his past with a, a, a lady that's in the industry that i'm not gonna do i'm not gonna even put that out there like that if that's corny then obviously what this young lady did she had to come up of her life she said she got six thousand dollars she said she had a pocket full of money and she couldn't help herself because she was with a celebrity, she had to go line, go online and, and talk about what allegedly happened. A porn star who couldn't keep her mouth closed. That is something. There's a bar in that, you missed it. You missed that bar that I just gave you guys. Stay off that 1942 if you can't stay off that phone and handle your liquor. This is an unfortunate story. This one sucks. The block is hot, the block is hot. 
I am wishing little baby all the best with his queen. Hey, man, people make mistakes. Jada, get a man another shot. All right, that's just what I'm putting out there. I'm rooting for black love. We are rooting for our kings and queens to settle our differences out offline. All right, do I sound positive enough? I am rooting to me for the biggest rapper in 2020 that he get his, his lady back. And if he don't, damn it, that means we're going to get some more emotionally scarred music. And that was hard as hell. So either way it go, selfishly as a fan of Lil Babies, we gonna win. I either my, my dog get his lady back. If he don't, we gonna get some hard ass music from Lil Baby on this new album in 2021. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this one. I feel uncomfortable. I don't even like videos like this. So we we tried to make this as fun as possible because I don't really care what happens in people's bedrooms. Only reason why we're addressing this because the biggest rapper in the world decided to address it. All right, looks like Lil Baby allegedly got caught up. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this one in the comment box below. Couldn't even enjoy that damn Richard Milley watch for, for 72 hours. Damn, Las Vegas. Uh, thank you guys so much for the time. Love, support is what I don't take for granted. Salute. I'm out.